I want us to look at this next problem. Now you know how to deal with radical signs, the square roots and the cube roots and stuff like that. Uh, this is not arranged in a standard form. This is also not arranged in a standard form. Let us arrange it first. I'm not differentiating yet. I'm just arranging it. How is this going to be? I've got 4 over, this is x to the power 1 over 2, right? So you just have 2 here, you've got 1 there, take 2 divided by that 1 here, that's where we got this half from. Let's look at this one, let's arrange it. This is equals to, what do we have there? We've got 1 over 9, and this is x cubed. ax to the power n, now this one is arranged, let's deal with this one. So it's going to be y is equals to. All right, let's take this x on top. It will be 4 x to the power minus 1 over 2 minus 1 over 9 x to the power 3. ax to the power n, ax to the power n. Once it is in that form, then you can find your dy dx. This then will be equals to, you take the exponent, you multiply it to this side, then you subtract one. That's what we are doing. That's the only rule that we are playing with. This times that, what is half of minus four? Okay, minus half of four, it will give us minus two, x to the power, minus half minus one. Uh, minus half and minus one. It's minus half and minus one. So this will be minus three over two. That's what we have here. It will give us minus three over two minus half minus one. It's minus, minus one and a half, right? Let's look at this one. This times this, it will give us minus, we've got uh, three, it's one over three. Yes, one over three. X to the power, three minus one, it will give us uh, two. That's what we have, that's right. This is what we will be our derivative. Let's move on. Uh, I want us to clean this one to be positive. This then will be, we've got minus two on top. If we take this thing down, it will be over X to the power, positive three over two. Right, this is exactly as it is. It is minus, uh, you can have it as minus x squared over three. Let me just clean this one further. This would be minus two over, this is square root. This is square root of x cubed. Remember, there was two yet divided there. I'm taking it back. This is minus x squared over three. This is dy dx in that form. At times, you'll find questions that says evaluate. When it says evaluate, you're looking for the actual value. It is a particular number. It can be 5, it can be 200, it can be anything. It will be without the variable. When we say evaluate, you are looking for the actual, actual value. 